The time has come for the final event of the Marvel Sports Games 2020 B-League. And the crowd knows it. They are excited and ready to see who can take home the crown here in the Blueberry Bowl. It's the Marathon. Welcome everybody, I'm the Emperor. The test team here to demonstrate what's gonna be. It looks like a short sprint on a wooden segment before bouncing off the ramp and into the water. As the green test marble will take the victory there. The referees have set up posts down at the bottom here. As we go to our first heat with six teams eligible to win the t championship. Three of them in here, all but the White Dragons. They are off and rolling. And the Cannonballs have flown off the track! They're gonna redo the heat. The Cannonballs are fine. They didn't land too hard, but... They were off and rolling again. And the White Dragons initially had the lead, but they were just completely swarmed. The Cannonballs take the lead. Uh, I don't know who got second there. It was a spirited charge from the Leaping Lemons, but was it enough to pass the Captain of Balls of Fire? No. Fireball will barely pip Lemonhead. And the Cannonballs did recover nicely, and will be moving on. Oddballs, Blue Moons, Bronze Tigers, and Team Eagle. A lot of which, not out so goodly here. They won bronze in speed skating, and they're going to advance along with Azor of the Blue Moons. That was a nice block there from Hawk on Inferno. Just kind of drafting over there. Good time there from Azor, 6.89. Time for the next heat with the Chili Cat's Eyes, the Bumblebees, Rouge Relays, and the ge Green Geese. And Chili Cat's Eyes out to a lead here. And they're going to get a bad, bad jump off the ramp. Bumblebees will advance, Rouge Relays will take second. And the Chili Cat's Eyes have not been doing well of recently. They got a bronze in balancing, but have plummeted since. The fans know that this is the heat to watch, because the Citron Sprinters are in this heat. They get a good finish here. I think they might be able to seal the championship. They have chosen Lime, Celestic Science, and Snowballs will be their competitors. They're out to a lead here, but it's all going to come undone. They're going to bounce into the water, and I don't think they're going to advance. They are not! The Celestic Science and Snowballs will! The Citron Sprinters are out of this event. Would look to be a pretty slow time, too. At 9.34, I think that is only better than the White Dragons. Which means that the Citron Splendors will net one point on the event, which means the door is wide open for the remaining competing teams. Semi-final one here. Team Eagle and the Celestic Science up in the lead. But the the Bumblebees are going to get advancement, along with Team Eagle. That was a good block there from Bumble. Balls of Fire tried the same draft move, but it did not work this time. Hawk will move on, along with Bumble. So we go to the second semi-final here with Snowy, Rouge On, Nonb, and Azure. They are off, but the Rouge Relays out in the front, the Snowballs in second. But the Snowballs are going to get bounced to the back, the Rouge Relays will win, the Cannonballs will come second. And the Cannonballs might have just taken the lead in the championship because of it. But the Rouge Relays are still fighting with them. These two teams are still mathematically alive. The final. Team Eagle. The Cannonballs. The Rouge Relays and the Bumblebees. Who will take home the final gold medal of this B-League? Two captains. And they're off and rolling. And immediately the Rouge Relays are after the lead. The Team Eagle's gonna pass it. Enter the water. Team Eagle will win! The Rouge Relays will come second. The Bumblebees. Nice block there for third. Was it enough for either of those two teams to pass the Citron Sprinters? Hawk will take home the gold. Team Eagle will have a good result here, and I think they will qualify for the qualifiers. Yeah, and 14th for the Citron Sprinters. Only better than the White Dragons, who I believe will be eliminated. But it is Team Eagle standing atop the podium, followed by the Rouge Relays and the Cannonballs. And what does it do to the overall standings? It is not enough! Even with the tie-in points, the Citron Splinters will win the B-League. The Rouge Relays will come in third, one point behind the Cannonballs. The four teams not advancing, more importantly, are the Green Geese, Chili Cat's Eyes, the Snowballs, and the White Dragons. But the Citron Splinters will win the B-League. The Cannonballs will come second. The Rouge Relays will come third. All of the top 11 teams will be competing in the Marble Sports Games Winter 2021 Qualifiers. Thank you so much for watching this B-League. 
stay tuned for the finale of the Marble Sports Games 2020, the same event, where the exciting title race continues. Thank you, I'm signing off.